Good morning. Okay, so it is Friday and I am about to go and do day one of my three day workshop to become a personal trainer. Um, it's very exciting, it's been a long time coming. Um, I've been doing lots of studying online, doing lots of um, sort of workshops on my computer. Um, but today we are gonna be going through the more practical side. Um, so this is the first part in me um, starting this qualification. So I have to do level two, um, get my gym instructor qualification, and then I can do level three and do the personal training side of it. Yeah, so all very exciting. Um, future fit training, who I'm actually doing this with. Um, I am gonna be hopefully taking you with me, gonna be doing a little bit of vlogging. Um, I will take you through kind of the process, all the things that I've been doing, um, and yeah, hopefully, Fingers crossed I pass. Um, I'm a little bit nervous. I haven't done anything like this for a while, um, like studying assessments. So yes, I'm a little bit scared, um, but everybody seems lovely on the course so far. So fingers crossed, um, all goes well this weekend. And I will hopefully show you as much as I can, but it is time for me to go. Okay, so what we are doing at the minute, we are just having a practice, demonstrating the warm-up and using the exercises. So as you can see, we've got Elizabeth and Tom in the background here, and Elizabeth is explaining how to use the cross, the treadmill on a warm-up. I have just done the cross trainer back there where those guys are doing it. Yeah, going well so far. Um, how do we progress that, sorry? Take a step. So our first one is our line quadriceps stretch. This works the front of the upper leg, which is our quad, okay? So we can flex those, so teach the head, teach those two. Lay on the front of the right now, and then close the one arm, and then put the two arms in the legs. Yeah, and then hold it for about a minute. Little. Okay, I am back home. I'm almost six o'clock. Um, it has been a long day, but day one is complete. Um, oh, why am I a bit out of focus? Ben, who is our tutor, is brilliant. Um, has been in the fitness industry for like 13 years, I think he said. Um, really knowledgeable, really good at um, explaining everything and putting it all across. Hey okay, K-Pops. And yeah, the whole group, everybody that's there are a great bunch of people, all like completely different walks of life, um, but all lovely people, really good to get on with, really enjoyed spending the first day practicing, um, explaining how to do stretches, how to use some cardiovascular equipment. First thing that we did though was a test. Um, but yeah, hopefully, fingers crossed, um, I pass, I have to get 70%. Tomorrow I have another test, absolutely dreading this one because it is anatomy. So I'm gonna do some more studying <laughs> tonight. Also have some homework to do. So yeah, so really busy day. Really, ex like really, really happy with it though. That buzz of helping people um, has come back and I really, really like it. So I'm excited to do more. But tomorrow we are doing some more practical stuff. We have a test in the morning, but the main bulk of it is all in the gym or in a studio and actually practicing how to take someone through a gym program. That is day one complete. Um, tomorrow I will show you a lot more, hopefully, of like the practical side of things um, because that is essentially what it's all about. So yeah, see you tomorrow. Good morning. So it is day two of Future Fit gym instructor training. Oh, it is cold. 
looking forward to doing a little bit more practical. Don't want to do the exam this morning, but yeah, it's got to be done. Okay, so we have just done a morning of classroom stuff and um, we also had our final test um, and now we're about to head to the gym and do all of our practical stuff. <laughs> yeah, we're on. Thank you. Right, so we have just finished our practical training um, of how to use the machine weights. Um, and yeah, how do you think it went, Brenda? No, well, I think it went. Yeah? It's really good. Yeah, enjoyed it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's really good. Learning yeah. a lot. Yeah, I learned a lot from you, <laughs> and as well as coaching you. I didn't pay him to say that, by the way. <laughs> it was very informative. Yeah. I learned a few things that I didn't know. Yeah. Good stuff. Uh, yeah, it's a lot to include one of the but yeah, really yeah. good. Perfect, good. So we're going back to the classroom now um, and yeah, cover a little bit more um, of the programming that we have to do and yeah. hopefully pass next time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fingers crossed, pass all this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> perfect. Theory side of things. Yeah. And then we're off. On my way, day three, final day, find out if I've passed the assessments and um, yeah, get prepared for our practical assessment in a few weeks. Okay, so me and Anna, we just Hi. went through um, a practice assessment, didn't we? Um, so I did 30 minutes, I just took Anna through um, a few bits and then Anna is just... She was in. very good because <laughs> yeah. uh, I'm a foreigner, I'm from Romania, so yeah. <laughs> it's a language barrier sometimes, but she's very good. Yeah, and Anna did very well as well. Yeah, we've just given each other a little bit of feedback, sat here on the mat, <laughs> um, and now we're going to have some lunch, and then this afternoon we're going to learn... Good morning, it is Monday post gym instructing um, weekend and I'm so so happy that I passed all of the exams. I was quite nervous about that and I was convinced that I'd failed but I got 80% on that and I got 85% on um, sort of the programming and the manual health and safety side of it. So really really happy. 
finally um, can kind of just breathe a little bit of a sigh of relief um, because now I can go into my practical assessment which is going to be in February um, and yeah I can just nail that hopefully and yeah pass with flying colours so it has been such a good weekend um, I'm very tired hence the, um, the bags under my eyes but it was worth it um, really um, informative weekend um, our tutor for the weekend Ben he was brilliant I knew so much and so um, insightful in, in giving examples of, of how he might use it or how the experiences that he's had because he's been in the industry um, for so long so that was brilliant it was working with um, or I was doing it with a bunch of amazing people um, from like all walks of life and that have experienced so many different things which was just brilliant to be around so nice to be around people that were passionate about um, health and fitness from a different side of things um, and coming coming at it from a different angle and yeah I you know I learned a lot obviously coming from training being my job um, you don't necessarily have to think about how you approach a bar or free weights or you know why you use certain machines and why a program might be set up in a certain way um, you know you kind of just just do it and yeah I forgot how much I really enjoy um, you know learning new things and it was great just to be um, I guess back in that coaching training helping environment again um you know ugh, being a badminton coach was brilliant and i and i loved doing that so the last like three four months where i've not done any of it i've really missed it um so now actually learning how to be able to coach people and train people in a health and fitness environment is perfect because not everybody wants to learn how to play badminton <laughs> um, but a lot of people want to get fit and a lot of people want to just better themselves and I'm really excited to be able to um, yeah start doing that once I've qualified so I will do my level two practical assessment in February and then um, yeah taking my husband I think to, to so I can teach him and deliver it and get um, assessed on that and then once I've passed that I will be going straight into my level three and that will um, allow me to be a personal trainer I need to say a huge thank you to um, the Dame Kelly Homes Trust because they are in partnership with future fit training and without um, being an athlete mentor for them I wouldn't have had the opportunity to work so closely with future fit so thank you um, future fit for putting on such um, great informative educational and um, fun um, workshops and I'm really really grateful to, to both parties I'm really looking forward to developing um, myself further if you are considering being a personal trainer or you want to be a pilates instructor or you're you've already got your qualification future fit actually have so many more personal development courses that you can do hopefully this has yeah, helped anybody make up their mind if they want to do it or not um, or even just somebody that's interested and loves training like I do to maybe just go out and do a course you learn so much um, and that will better you and then obviously you can advise your friends and family um, and and if you really want then you can start charging people for it so yeah um, yeah that is me I'm gonna wrap this video up there so yeah thank you for watching and see you soon